my channel and if you're new then welcome and today's video is a trader joe's haul as y'all can see obviously um this week i decided to go full on vegetarian so starting today which is monday which hopefully will be the day y'all send this video um i'm gonna be vegetarian for seven more days so i think i did it once before i think the longest i went was like six or seven days but yeah, I'm just gonna show y'all everything I got, and I'm also gonna show y'all one of the vegetarian meals that I'm gonna be trying out that's on Pinterest. So, yeah. Okay, so I got some eggs, nothing fancy. I got two bottles of this Trader Joe's garlic salt. Y'all, this is the best garlic salt ever. <laughs> like, I'm not kidding. So, uh, this garlic salt. I already have some. This is actually for my mom. She wanted me to get her some because they didn't have it the last time she went. It has sea salt in it, roasted garlic, onion, and parsley. The next thing I got is two boxes of these snickerdoodles, y'all. These are so good and they're vegan and gluten free. Um, so if you want some vegan cookies, these are bomb. Oh, yeah, and all this stuff, y'all, cost me $82 and some change. So, Trader Joe's is really affordable. Next thing I got is these roasted seaweed snacks with sea salt. I've never had this. I just wanted to try it. It was a dollar, so I was like, why not? Next thing I got is these strawberry cereal bars. These are really good. This soy cheese blend. It's um lactose-free cheese. And it's really good. So, yeah, I really like this cheese. I've been using it for a while now. Next, I got this very green 100% juice smoothie. It has banana, mango, apple, pineapple juice, green foods, and other added ingredients is what it says. But this is so good. Oh, all the ingredients are right here. Um, it's apple juice, banana puree, mango puree, pineapple juice, kiwi puree, spirulina, chlorella, greens blend, which is the broccoli, spinach, barley grass, ginger, blue green algae, parsley, garlic, and all that sounds nasty, but this is delicious, y'all. I promise you, I won't lie. These are delicious. Well, I mean. You might not like it, but I do, so it could be a lie. Next thing I got is some chicken broth. I don't know if this counts as, like, vegetarian or not, but I don't really like vegetable broth. And one of the um recipes that I'm going to be trying, I needed some broth, and I decided to go with chicken. Next, I got some Italian parsley. Um... It's just for decoration. And that's it. Next, I got some whipped cream cheese. And then I got this spinach tortellini. And it has, it's stuffed with spinach, ricotta, mozzarella, and parmesan cheese. And this is like really quick to make. So, yeah. Okay, y'all. I just got some organic baby spinach. Got some fresh cut mangoes. I'm still trying to decide if I actually like mangoes or not. Like, I have frozen mangoes that I put in my smoothie, but, like, by themselves, I don't know. Next, I got some pineapple chunks. Pineapples are delicious. So, yes. Then, I got some organic zucchini. This is actually going to, I'm going to be using this in one of the recipes that i'm showing y'all today next i got two bags of this vegetable fried rice you can make so many different meals with this rice like honestly i've been eating this rice for so long they do have the chicken fried rice as well i don't even like how the chicken tastes in there though it don't even taste like real chicken if i'm being honest but the vegetable fried rice is pretty good next i got some rice cauliflower um I forgot what I was going to cook with this, but y'all are seeing one of these upcoming videos. <laughs> I actually bought a bag of this before, and I didn't know what to make, and it ended up going bad, and I had to throw it out. So, yeah. 
And next, I just got three bags of these broccoli florets. And then my last food item is these vegetable samosas. I actually bought some of these last week and cooked them, but I didn't even eat them. So I bought some more. My sister tried them, and she said that they were good. So I'm going to try them this week, y'all, and see what they taste like. I had the chicken ones. Those are bum. So I definitely want to see how these are going to taste. Okay, y'all. That was my last food item. The next thing I got is just, like, some skincare stuff. This is some uh, French liquid soap with vitamin E. And it says it's orange blossom and honey. Oh, you got really good ingredients. It has spirits of water, coconut, and olive oil, natural vegetable glycerin, um, tea tree. I mean, whatever this is. Tea, I don't know. Uh, leaf extract, vitamin E, natural fragrance with essential oils, and it's no animal testing. So, yeah, this is smell really good, though. So, I was like, okay. The next thing I got is some skincare stuff. I'm actually going to be trying out Trader Joe's skincare. So, that's going to be another video I'm going to be making. So, if y'all interested in that. Definitely stay tuned, but I got um, this face wash, and I got these facial cleansing pads. I think these like a makeup removing pads. I do have one of their face masks, a face moisturizer, and lip balms, but I'm going to show all that in the actual video. And I figured out one last thing I got is some ground ginger. Um, I bought this to put in my teas. I have like some ground turmeric as well. Um, Trader Joe's actually do sell ginger and turmeric tea, which I love. That's my favorite tea. But for when I have, like, my other teas and I want to add extra benefits, I got ginger and turmeric because they're really good for your immune system. But, y'all, that is all I have for the haul video. And now I'm going to show y'all one of the recipes. Okay, y'all, so I'm going to be showing y'all how to make this two-in-one recipe. Um, this recipe is just the same stuffing, but just with some crackers. Okay, y'all, so first I'm going to take my zucchini and I'm going to rinse it off. We don't want no dirty vegetables. And after that, I'm just going to cut off the ends, um, both sides. And yeah, cut it down the middle and take out the inside. Okay, y'all, so I'm about to preheat my skillet while I chop up the zucchini. And I'm just going to put a little olive oil in the skillet and add all my seasonings.
Okay, y'all, so while I let the zucchinis bake, I'm just preparing the other meal. Like I said, it's the same stuffing. I just put some cheese on it, melted it in the microwave, and added these crackers. Um, The crackers, actually, I end up not liking them. It was good, like, the first bite. Then after I kept eating, I was just like, mm, no, nah, I don't like these crackers. So I just end up using some regular crackers, but you can use whatever you like. Okay, y'all, so I ended up taking my zucchinis out the oven and putting it in the microwave because the lactose-free cheese, it doesn't really melt that good. So, yeah, and then I just sprinkled some smoked paprika on it, and that was it. All right, y'all, that's the end of this video. Let me know if y'all try this out, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel because I am going to have another video on me trying out some vegan recipes